Yo, what's up everybody? It is Shimso here. I just wanted to make this video to give you a quick PSA about the new Rift Herald that came in the latest update. This thing is a lot different from the older Rift Herald. It is much, much easier to secure. As you can see, I'm here on Yorick. I have a Caulfield's Warhammer and a Pickaxe. I don't even have my Death Dance yet. I'm level 9. I've just gotten 5 points in my queue, and look how much damage I'm doing to this thing. The biggest thing here is that you can actually hit its eye 1v1. It gives you opportunities when it's attacking to get behind it and do like a thousand damage whenever you hit that eye. And as you can see, I'm going to get this Rift Herald in about 45 seconds at level 9. With no ult, no minions, nothing. Uh, you can, I, I, I've done this on Alawi also, level 9, but I, I think you need a Death Dance on Alawi. If I had a Death Dance here on Yorick, I probably would have gotten out with full HP, I'm pretty sure. But, um... I'm not, I'm not really sure about Singed, if, uh, I guess maybe you could try like a Sunfire Rush, because Sunfire does a lot of extra damage to minions and monsters now. But the point is that you can 1v1 it very, very easily now, because it gives you opportunities to hit the Eye. The new Rift Herald will give you, it will replace your Trinket slot with the Eye of the Rift Herald, which while you have it, it lasts for 4 minutes. Uh, it will give you the Baron Empowered Recall, so it will half your recall time. And then when you use it, it will channel for 4 seconds and basically put the Rift Herald into a, the, the closest lane. It will go for the closest tower and it will do massive damage with a charge attack and continue to hit it. Now the important thing to note is that it will be in your trinket slot. So if you're used to you know, popping ward, you're going to see it right here. I'm going to walk into this bush. I saw a leader. I want to drop a ward in this bush. I accidentally used the Rift Herald instead. So be careful with that. It will take up your, uh, your trinket slot there. So if you're used to you know, hitting forward a ward, be careful, make sure you don't do that when you got the Rift Herald. Uh, so it is going to be a waste here. But you can do it very, very easily. You can solo it now with probably most champions. If, if your champion has any form of sustain, you can almost certainly solo the Rift Herald easily at like level 9. Probably even earlier on a lot of the champions. So keep that in mind. It is severely under contested right now. I would highly recommend, if you're thinking about going to rank, go in now and just get the Rift Herald at level 9 all the time. Uh, you will constantly secure towers with it. Uh, it does a lot of damage. That initial charge does like half of the tower's HP if minions are nearby. And it's a great pushing tool, especially if no towers are going down yet. Whether you're top or mid, if you've got a champion that can do it, grab it and then just go and get that first tower and get that that 500 gold boost, that huge gold boost for your team. So yeah, this is a PSA on the Rift Herald. Be sure to take advantage of it. It's probably not going to remain uncontested uh, by the large amount of players for a long long time, or well, mu much longer, because I think we're going to spread that this thing is ridiculously easy to take and has a ridiculous effect. So yeah, keep that in mind, guys. Thank you for watching. Take care.